hi guys welcome back to my channel and welcome to another another haul sorry that was so good <laughs> That was so good, did you hear the vocals? Anyways guys, welcome back to another haul. Today we are doing a wedding guest haul because we're in April now, spring has sprung and I believe that's when weddings begin. And yeah, we just wanna look cute, we wanna look put together, we wanna look fabulous when we go to these weddings. And do you know what? Someone actually requested this video. I believe her name was Shola. So this is for you, Shola. And I hope that you enjoy it, guys. I've just gone to the shops, the main culprits, Mango, Zara, and H&M. And I've got a few pieces that you could potentially wear to your weddings. And when you go to weddings, you wanna look elegant, you wanna look classy, you wanna look beautiful. Beautiful. I feel like all of these dresses embody that. So yeah, let's get into it guys because you know that I don't like to waste no time at the beginning of the video. <laughs> let's get into it. Okay, so first up we have this absolutely stunning dress from H&M which is why I had to show you guys it first because look at the orange. Look at the orange on my skin. Are you actually joking what i love about the dress the most is the ruching in here and the ruching around the stomach and it's got like this cut out area which goes to the back guys how stunning i'm gonna move back for you because it is a maxi dress it goes all the way to the floor and i feel like maxi dresses are perfect for weddings obviously it's april it's not all the way hot yet so long sleeves all the way covered would be perfect for a wedding and i feel like yes when you walk into the wedding people are going to be staring because look at the way the orange is sitting on my skin the ruffles around this area actually had my food part really really well the only downside i would say is that i don't think you can sweat in this because of the color because of the material if you start to sweat you will start to show so i would say sort that situation out before you go or make sure it's a wedding that's outside so that you can be cool but still look cute <laughs> love this let me just turn around for you so you can see what it looks like on the back it does have an opening there if you can see that and i have paired it with some rose gold heels because i feel like rose gold or gold and orange pair really nicely with each other so yeah i put the bob as well so that you guys can see the dress in all of its glory because if there was like a long wig or if it was like curly you wouldn't really see the detail let me move a bit closer you wouldn't see the detail of this dress oh absolutely stunning guys what do you think next up is this dress from zara i would say it's like a ombre tie-dye effect dress it's in a satin material and it's a midi length i have paired it again with the rose gold heels because i feel like this color goes really well with it i like this i do really like this i'm not too sure about the cow neck but I think this is perfect. This is given very wedding season. This is given very wedding guest. I'll show you what it looks like from the back. Again, I love the ruching on the side. Ruching is so good because you can eat freely. <laughs> when I go to a wedding, I want to eat free. I want to have a good time. I want to dance. I don't want to be thinking about holding my stomach in. So anything with ruching, chef's kiss. I love it. So yeah, I think the color goes really well with my skin tone. I feel like if you had an olive skin tone as well, it would be really nice, it would really pop. It has no sleeves, but I guess you could put a blazer over the top if it gets chilly as the day goes on. But apart from that, love, absolutely love. This is very different. It's not like just one color, it's not one tone. Basically, it reminds me of the desert. <laughs> It's like desert safari, can, I don't know, guys, okay? I do not know, but I feel like this is a good look. This is a good look for a wedding, paired with a clutch or a little cute little bag and you're good to go. So yeah, also goes with the hair and you guys know how I feel about dresses going with my hair. <laughs> I am so, so sorry, but if this is not the epitome of wedding guest dress, then what is huh i don't even really like pink but i feel like pink is really in for this season like this spring summer season so there is actually two more pink dresses in this haul but this ah, uh, guys are 
are you joking i hope you guys can see this i normally don't even like prints as well my dresses but when i saw this i was like mm, this is gonna be nice i did get in a size too big i think i got in a medium so i will go down to a small but how stunning is this dress let me show you what it looks like from the back the oh god are you joking like sorry so sorry i'm getting gas let me calm down look at this look at the back look at the detail at the back if my back is dry i'm so sorry but i want you to see the detail at the back i have paired it with my uh really sparkly heels i'm not wearing no shape wear underneath and i'm not even wearing a bra but i did wear some nipple covers this dress is made of a really chiffony material so it has no holding or anything like that it has no support on the bra area or around the tummy area but because it's chiffony it doesn't cling to you so i feel like again this is a really perfect dress for a wedding oh guys are you joking okay guys so next up is this would you say this is neon green i would say neon green neon green dress from mango i got it in a size 10 because i keep on forgetting to say the sizes that i got it in basically it's this strapless dress but it's got like this situation going on so can you see that the front is like <laughs> but yeah i like this situation because if you can see it just hits right above the belly i know like guys i don't know why i keep on talking about that but i feel like this is one of my problem areas so anything that can help me with that i'm all for it and i know if it's a problem area for me it might be a problem area for you so anything that can cover it up i'm all for it i can't even lie it's got that situation going on there which adds a bit of character to the dress i'm not sure about the color but i really wanted to include different colors that i wouldn't normally wear and also if we're going to weddings in spring let's match the vibe of spring i think this color is very springy or is it is it just me i paired it with my white bottega heels i've also got the dupes of this from zara they go with so much so i would highly recommend and then for jewelry because obviously it is strapless i put this necklace on as well with the bracelet to match so i feel like that's how i would wear it and with a bag the thing is i really need to invest in more dressy bags like nice clutches to go with these outfits i feel like i don't have that many so this summer that is one of my goals to get more dressy bags i feel like all you need is a gold one a silver one probably one that goes with other colors and then you're good to go because i can't wear any of my casual bags with these dresses no way no way jose let me show you what it looks like from the back and yeah it's a maxi dress which again i love i think maxi and mini dresses for wedding chef's kiss also if you want to wear trousers and a jumpsuit is absolutely perfect because i honestly feel like when you go to weddings you're meant to be elegant you're meant to be classy it's not a time to wear like a bodycon short dress but do you know what let me not let me not say too much because i know how you girls like to tussle <laughs> let's move on to the next one so i'm not really a big fan of red but I do these hauls for you guys, so I always need to bear in mind that you might be a fan of red. But I love the style of this dress. It did come in another colour, so I'll link it down below. But this is also very, very nice for a wedding. Yes or no? Yes or no, guys? Oh my gosh! I think it's coming up a bit orange on the screen, but it is 100% red. It's like a nice red as well. It's like a sharp red, which is cute. I don't think red suits me because I have more of a yellow undertone under my skin. That's a completely separate video that I need to do because I feel like certain colours work better with certain skin tones. But we'll get into that another time. It's got pleats all the way down. I think my favourite detail is this situation going like, what is this? I would say this is asymmetrical, right? I am wearing like a sharpless bra with it and I did get it in a size 10, I believe, which is honestly perfect i love how long it comes basically at the bottom is just a little bit longer on the sides so your shoes peep through hopefully you can see that on camera i love how it flows when you're walking oh 
guys i love wedding season i need to get invited to more weddings i feel like my friends need to get married because i need weddings to go to anyways this is what it looks like from the front this is what it looks like from the back i paired it with my sparkly silver shoes because i feel like red and silver go better together than red and gold but that's just me i prefer silver to go with this type of red don't ask me why i just do so yeah silver shoes silver jewelry but i feel like this goes really well together yay nay let me move back for you one more time hey mambo mambo italiano <laughs> that's what it, that's what it reminds me of let me change to the next dress because i'm i don't know maybe i'm delirious like i don't actually know what is going on sorry i absolutely love this dress you know when they say simple but effective this is what they're talking about this is what they're talking about because this is a simple silver satin dress what is that alliteration sss -S -S. anyways <laughs> look how stunning it is i'm just gonna move back so that you can see it again it's a maxi dress but absolutely love the way it hugs my figure and also it gives room here it's not too tight around this area also with these they're adjustable at the back stunning i love this and then i just thought okay this is nice for wedding but you could probably do it like for a date night or if you have like a gala or an event later on in the year and then you could put a blazer over the top like so oh are you actually joking wow stunning stunning i love this you know what i don't really wear silver but like i said guys these hauls i don't really do it for myself i do it for you guys because imagine if i see one of you guys wearing this stunning dress i probably would scream my head off but anyways i paired it with this blazer that i also got from h&m i love the quality and i love the way they've done the cutouts at the bottom of the dress i don't know if you'll be able to see it on camera but i'll link it so that you can see the dress in all of its glory let me move forward so you can see what it looks like here i'm not wearing no bra only nipple covers this is what it looks like at the back i love i absolutely love mm, get down on it get down on it hey, get down on it it's like candy okay sorry do you know what let me be serious on to the next dress pink to make the boys wink so another pink dress i feel like pink is really in for spring i love this asymmetrical dress guys you know i love asymmetrical things asymmetrical tops dresses all of the above and this has got the extra fabric across the right arm here and this one has nothing on this side so if i move back for you this is what it looks like again another maxi dress but i love it it has this slit on the side just a little one so that you can see the shoes and you can walk freely Woo! girl girl i paired it with my white bottega heels and to be fair i feel like this white bag also goes with it what do you guys think I think pink and white is a really nice combination. Pink and white or pink and silver. Silver or white would go really, really, really well with this dress. This is what it looks like from the back. I love this side. And do you know what I love about this dress the most? The material, almost like linen and cotton mixed together. It's so breathable. I feel so, so comfortable. In terms of material, this is probably my favorite one of all the dresses that i've tried on i love how it makes me feel i love how free i am and i feel like even after you wash it yeah it would still be really really nice to wear like i don't think washing it will ruin the quality i love i i love guys do you know what i'm not gonna lie i feel like i picked the best things i do i do <laughs> fun fact one time i did a haul and someone actually got on to me for not including a black dress so in this one i'm gonna make sure there's a black dress me personally i don't think i would wear a black dress to a wedding unless it was part of the dress code so let's get into this dress i got this from h&m and this is in a size small very 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 stretchy so yeah you can be on the dance floor all night it has the bat wing effect as well which i really love because i feel like if you were to put on a tiny bit of weight no one would see it 
no one would see you could wear this dress for years to come this dress is good for weddings but also i feel like date night would be good dinner with the girls a gala something it's not just weddings that you have to wear this dress to i don't know if you can see the detail but all through the middle it's got ruching on the dress i don't know if you can see that let me come a bit closer you guys know exactly how i feel about ruching so let me not say it again and bore you to death but i've paired this dress with my sophia webster heels they have some sparkly bits at the front i don't know if you can see that this is what it looks like from the front from the side i love black it's so slimming and then this is what it looks like from the back I absolutely love it. This is definitely one that you need in your wardrobe all the time. Because if someone just calls you, oh, babe, babe, oh, we, we're going for dinner a couple of hours, you can just put this on and you're good to go. You don't have to be thinking, oh my God, what should I wear? What should I wear? You just get a black dress, accessorize really well, and you'll look good. As long as your makeup and your hair is banging, you're going to look great. Okay, so last but not least, we have this special number from Zara. Like I said in the beginning, there were three pink dresses in the haul. This one is from Zara, the other two are from Mango. So I think pink is like the theme for spring. It might be, I don't know, but when I went to all the shops, that's what I saw. That's what I saw online, that's what I saw in the shops. So anyways, this one is a satin midi dress and it has long sleeves but also the sleeves have zips on them i don't know if like probably they made a mistake and they tried to rectify it because when i zip it up actually it's not that bad when i zip it up but it could be a bit more freer so i don't know if they added the sleeves in after they realized it would be too tight but it adds a bit of character to the dress and you guys know how i feel about that it has this deep v-neck i am wearing a bra so it does look a bit funny but i think it's for the girlies that have the smaller bust because this bit is meant to like kind of lie flat and it's meant to come quite deep but it doesn't look that bad on me i'm not gonna lie if you do have a bigger bust i feel like it still works i have paired it with these white heels that i wore with the other pink dress because like i said pink and white they go hand in hand this is like a deeper pink i do really like it it is a bit more covered which is also perfect for spring because just because we're in spring doesn't mean there's going to be sunshine all the time i really like how well this goes with my skin tone i think for the price point is really good as well this was 49.99 and i got this in a size small so i don't really feel bad because sometimes Zara can make me feel bad. I can be a large some days and some days I can be an extra small. So I feel like this is just right. So if you were going to get it, get your actual size. I love the length of it. I really, really, really do love the colour. It's like a really shiny satin pink. Would you call this hot pink or fuchsia pink? I don't know, but I really, really love it. I think gold or silver jewellery would go really well with it. Mm, probably silver for me. I, I think I would do silver personally but you guys can choose anything you want so guys we have come to the end of the haul i have the best time filming these guys i honestly do this video was recommended so if you want to recommend another one then leave it down in the comments do you need some holiday inspo do you need some like birthday dresses inspo that would be a good one that would be a really good one anyways leave it all in the comments also let me know in the comments which dress that you like the most and if you'll be getting any for the weddings that you have coming up yeah don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i will see you on the next video guys bye guys <laughs>